Hi, my name is James Clem. When you're in your design theater with your CEREC in your design screen, hopefully we don't have to use a lot of tools. On another video, I talked about my favorite design tool and I kind of felt bad because I compared it to two children. And you know, you always love your children the most. They all have their little temperaments. Well, my other favorite tool is the form tool. I like the form tool because I have two features that are really beneficial. I have paint brush size. I also have my strength option. I can effectively do subtle, and I'm going to repeat that operative word, subtle adjustments on my design screen. See, I don't want to fiddle. What I've noticed in my classes as I teach, a lot of users have a tendency to smooth their restorations too much. Now, when you smooth your restoration, it's not going to make a difference once it comes out of the milling unit, but you have a tendency to lose some of those subtle micromorphological effects of the restoration that automatically happens in the software. You don't want to remove that. So the form tool, which is one of my favorite tools, it's on par with the shape circular two direction. You want to use it carefully. I'm mainly going to use it to refine my interproximal contacts and bulk up my margins or smooth the margin if I need to. But keep that smooth tool away from the other elements on the facial and occlusal surfaces. You don't need to smooth those areas. I know it's a natural thing to do, but stay away from fiddling. Let the CEREC software work for you. Enjoy your form tool, but don't use it too much.